Uh, so it, when you when the LST went to Japan, what part of Japan did you land in? Oh, uh, in, in Tokyo. Uh, Tokyo. You went to Tokyo. Yeah, right up the, the, the main, main thing. Did you uh, did you do any? Uh, did you get off the ship and roll oh, around yeah, Tokyo? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I bummed around there and and went a few places and and they they were nice to me and all that. Uh, there were about a hundred and twenty guys on our ship and there were a few other ships came in there too and. Of course, and a lot of stuff happened, and so. Uh, but anyway, it's. Uh, uh, the, 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 of course, since then we have, as I mentioned, I think that we had eight kids, and and uh, we now we have thir thirty grand grandchildren, uh, and, and that's quite a, that's quite a few for, not bad for white folk, and uh, <laughs> and uh, in fact, you might be, maybe you've seen this picture. That's interesting. This this is something I keeps in my in my pocket here for people that sees it. This is a this is a, this is a picture of of uh, of our, my mother and, and our family and, and there's 150 people that are in there and and uh, there's my mom right in here and there's 10 kids and grandkids and all that stuff and and this is this is with me and and my wife me and. And, and Norm in here, and we have, as I say, we have uh, uh, eight kids and, and 30 grandchildren, and, and, and that's not bad. As I say, that's not bad for white folks. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, so uh, this is a, it, it, this picture was in the uh, in the uh, National Choir here. If you see, you don't see very many people in the, in, in the National Choir, but there it is. So, and, so the big bulk of, of the people in that picture. Uh, came from your from your marriage to Norm, right? So you two were married in Los Angeles, right? And then where'd you go, go from Los Angeles after you got married? Well, uh, we after the ship we docked in in Oregon, and then we we went back from Oregon on on a on the bus. We we were we were tight then. We still are, and we we went we 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 went we did airplanes weren't that that. that that easy that back then, but we uh, we uh, w went from there back to we went to Springfield, Missouri, because my folks had moved from St. Joe to Springfield, and so uh, so we we were then in uh, out on the uh, in Springfield, Missouri, and we and, and I got a job there and, and until I got fired for shooting off my mouth, and and uh, and, uh, and, and so then I moved to. To uh, what, what was the job you got fired from? It was it was uh, MFA. It's called uh, it's a uh, it's a uh, food uh, milk, milk company deal in in Springfield. Yeah. And in fact, my my dad uh, 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 they, they, we, I went to when I mentioned well anyway I got shoot off my mouth and I got fired and so then my my brother Ed. Call, he was in o, in Oklahoma City, and he said he he said he told me that I'd gotten fired, and said why, why don't you uh, come to Oklahoma City and get a job here? And I so well so I did, and I made a, a job over here, and and I and I went to work selling life insurance, and then eventually got into the real real estate business, and um, uh, and so and, and here we are, we we now we have. Uh, Everything going well, and I'm 77 years old. And uh, if I don't die too quick, why we'll uh, we're doing okay. When you uh, got into the insurance business in Oklahoma City, did uh, was there anything politically politically that uh, you got involved in that uh, uh, such you know politics, church affairs, any of that sort of thing? Oh, I always did. It. I always did all that stuff. That's how I got my got fired on that for shooting off my mouth, but. I, I was, but, but I was my own boss. I never, I couldn't get fired because I was, and, and so because of that, I, I, I get, I would talk about whatever I wanted to about religion or politics or whatever it was, and, and either I, the people who was talking to me, either, either they liked me or they didn't like me, so I either made some money or I, or, or, or I didn't get, didn't make any money. So that, so it's, but, but, uh, I, I think that maybe uh, it, it's, it's not a bad, bad idea to 
kind of get that uh, under control if it, 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 so, so that it doesn't screw uh, everything up too much. It kind of depends on take each situation at a time. Right. And, right. Well, there was a there was a there was a uh, piece of paper floating around town back in the '60s, I think, called the Yellow Sheet. Yeah. Had something to do with with uh, the Catholic religion. What well, do you know about that? Yeah. Well, this the Yellow Sheet was because of the fact that. In 19, I think it was 1963, uh, the uh, the uh, the uh, Catholic Church came out with a, what is called the the uh, New Ordo. That's New Order. As for Latin, that means New Ordo means they, they have they they had a new idea for a new new order for, about the Catholic Church. So I came out and and it's, so they tell me. That this thing came out called was called the yellow sheet, and and it was a, a yellow sheet, page of pa paper, and there were lots of comments and ideas and and, and remarks about about the Catholic Church uh, this way and that, uh, particularly in the in the situation about the about the, the new new ordo of, of the church, which is now different than what it was in, in that, that at that time. And uh, I, I guess something like that happens. I, I, if you remember that uh, the, uh, the Catholic Church uh, uh, got in trouble in the 15th century and the 12th century and so on, uh, for on and against religion back in there. And, and, uh, and uh, like Constantine got the thing going called Christianity back in, in the year of 385. And uh, that's uh, and, and, and the Catholic Church has been here and there ever since. So the Catholic Church today is, is isn't doing too good right now. In fact, there aren't very many uh, priests that, uh, available to, to run the Catholic Church now. In fact, while while we're talking about that, I thought, I thought about the other day that somebody I told somebody that the reason that I never was a priest was was that I couldn't sing. <laughs> <laughs> if you couldn't sing, you couldn't be in a priest. You 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 couldn't get up there and do it. So, uh, but anyway, that's uh, that's uh, about the way it's going. So. Did did, um, did you ever become active in in things that the federal government imposed, such as uh, busing? Oh yeah, horse busing and yeah. things of that nature. And well, in fact, that was back in those days. I. They, they had a, a deal about uh, ha oh having a I, I guess it's a, a, a busing where they they had uh, a, had uh, uh, a pe whether people were bused to go to church as uh, schools and and over over the over the uh, black issue by, by the ne the Negroes and so. Uh, they put me in jail over that, and so, uh, but I, uh, I did fine there. I, I went to I went to court over that, and I, I, I didn't use a lawyer. I just did it myself. And the guy told me that that I put on the you have to be a little, little uh, 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 what's, what's a bad word? I mean, a good word. But anyway, I I was I was um, uh, the. the, the the judge told me that I put on the best show he'd seen in the courtroom for 15 years, and uh, on my on my deal, and, 